morning. It's uh, day three today. So uh, I woke up quite early actually, about 4.45 to have a shower and then uh, just clear up some of the uh, things. And uh, now I'm having tea. Now it's just close to six o'clock in the morning. Uh, the sky is starting to get a bit brighter now. Uh, so today our ride will be going towards uh, Duku Pokari. From here to Duku Pokari is about 27 kilometers. So from 1,890 meters here, we have to go up to 3,200 meters. So it's quite a, a lot of elevation today. So we start a bit earlier today. Hopefully you can reach there by 3 or 4 in the afternoon. Yep, okay. It was such a peaceful morning and so nice to have tea, looking at the vegetation and also noticing that our tea house owner was preparing breakfast for us. This is our breakfast, Tibetan bread, eggs, this is honey. <laughs> Around uh, 7, 18 in the morning, just started our ride uh, out from the hotel, uh, from the guest house I mean. So we're going towards uh, Duku Pokari, yeah, Duku Pokari. So it'll be 27 kilometers, so yeah, today will be a lot of climbs to do. So slowly. So we just went through another check post, just a few meters away. Uh, now continue on our journey. Okay. This is a safe drinking water station. You can get some water here, top up water here. And look at the view. My goodness, such a beauty. And here we met a Slovenian friend, Gaspar, who has been cycling for nine months. Hello, Namaste. Beautiful. Just 
just something about the view of this marvelous and majestic peaks oh, and it's so peaceful and so quiet here it seems like uh, all living creatures are just being silent in the midst of these mountains oh. okay another 10 kilometers to go to reach Chame this is uh, Timang so yeah quite a nice uh, gradual uphill so far so not too hectic uh, and with all these views uh, it's really re rewarding yeah all right Timang kind of view huh Oh, beautiful ride today and also a beautiful day oh. Oh, this is this is Chame area. That's a lean. This is lunch at uh, near Chame area. Ah, so how about again? After this, we'll go straight towards uh, Dukupokari. Another 12 kilometers to go. Right. So entering a uh, Pisang area, this section is uh, still a bit steep and there's now elevation about uh, 3,300 meters above sea level. So slowly, I'm going to reach uh, Dukupokari. We aim to reach there before 3. Okay.
entering the woods. Oh, nice. So this is an apple farm and uh, this is the farmhouse area I think there's a place where you can have some tea and relax as well so so another three kilometers to Duku Pokari ah, so far so good This is the apple farm and we just had a nice refreshing uh, fresh apple juice at this uh, cafe here, very nice and uh, I think this whole place is really uh, unique because they have also a place where you can stay uh, over this farmhouse here, very nice. Oh, they even have wine here. I think they, they make some apple wine from uh, the farm here. Interesting. More climbs to do, but at least it's a concrete surface. Namaste Dev Gurung Okay, just reached uh, Gangapuna Hotel here at uh, Duku Pakari Alright I think Dave is not here yet so I'm gonna go in first and landlady is already beckoning me to go in so yeah probably just gonna have a nice uh, tea and uh, just clean up a bit Alright just had a really nice shower uh, so just resting first and let me show you the room okay so this is uh, Simpson and my room so I'm, I'm giving him this big bed I'm gonna sleep in the smaller one so this uh, charging port here and uh, yeah everything is a mess at the moment here <laughs> So I did some laundry as well, and uh, this is uh, Law's room, 
So he likes to be alone. <laughs> he prefers to have some privacy, so usually he takes uh, one room uh, by himself. So just waiting for Dave to arrive and uh, Simpson as well. Uh, okay. <laughs>